to you to you to you jaja jaja bo story time hot news pillar your favorite babe kirsty valentine thank you very much for tuning on to your favorite channel your favorite babe thank you for subscribing if you haven't please do press the red buttons uh, for subscription the bells button for notifications please always leave a comment share and like thank you very much for supporting this channel well it's not such a pleasant news the most and much celebrated socialite and former officer of the nigerian custom service mrs chinere ungo nadi popular popularly known she is popularly known and called Big Chi is dead. Uh, ROIP. She passed on at the early hours on Tuesday, October 28, 2020. Um, according to reports, she complained of a, a chest pain. Um, as you all know if you are very if you are very if you live in the london area if you are someone who um, loves events who loves uh, bc or latilo show or you are a fan of the ovation magazine she grazed the pages events of all these uh, high society hair brows uh, uh, party she was a very top official in the nigerian custom and she worked in the nigerian custom for a very very long time um she was at the tin can port at apapa um, in lagos she was there for a very long time she's so well known she's so very 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 well well connected she has she knows who and who in the society she has very good friends she has powerful and influ influential friends in nigeria and uh, lagos and in nigeria um it is known that she made a huge fortune whilst she had that top of uh, position at the nigerian custom she is well known to be a, a a party crooner she loved to go to party she had a huge huge appetite for parties a few years ago she took re retirement from uh, the nigerian uh, custom and service the reason why is because um it was uh, according to inside report uh, some officials in the uh, nigerian customs were not quite comfortable with the way she harassed uh, uh, within the organization they were not quite comfortable with her lifestyle um, and so um, a lot ho, 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 ha, 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 goes on so we don't need to go into all that we all know how it is so um, she had it is well known that she had uh, a godmother who held her back and she was very very close her closeness was of uh, to the top nigerian uh top most senior nigerian uh custom officer kofo Olubeson. she was a former top uh, official in the custom uh, big chi was really really close to her and it is well known that uh, kofo Olubeson was her godmother so obviously she had her back uh we know the politics how everything goes in 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 uh nigeria um but before long before uh we knew it the cabals within the nigerian custom and exercise they moved against her and ensured that she was demoted from her position the cabals in within the custom made sure that Big Chi, her name is Mrs. Chinere Ogonadi. Her position, she was demoted from her position and then transferred from Lagos. That is where the money is. Transferred from Lagos, where she has made, and it, it is allegedly and reported that she made her 
huge fortune from there. She was transferred to Calaba. Uh, 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 th these are two things. Transferred to Calaba and then demoted. So you, you can see the difference. So um, it is known that she was not able to cope. She was not comfortable with her demotion in her position, obviously. The people who used to call you ma or madam, who used to come to you and wait for your authority or approval, are now the ones that you are answering to. So you can imagine the uh, discomfort in that. You can imagine how the ridicule in it. So we know, we know our people, we know how they rule. So she retired and then came back to uh, Lagos. She's got children. Um, she recently went over to the United States of America to visit one of her sons and her grandchildren where she complained of chest pain. The ambulance was called for her to take her to the hospital. They arrived in time and on her way to the hospital, she gave up the ghost she passed on and when she got to the hospital she was pronounced dead on arrival so they were not able to resuscitate her they, i'm sure they did everything they could in the in the in the in the van in the ambulance but i guess it was her time so i would say rest in perfect peace she lived a very beautiful and colorful life she was blessed uh, just before she passed on, she was about to celebrate 40 years marriage with her husband before she passed on. So her heart goes to her loved ones, the ones she has, uh, that, that she has left behind, her sons, her grandchildren, her in-laws, and, you know, her family members. So R.O.I.P. Uh, Bichi uh, Chinere uh, Ungo Zani. So that's uh, that's it, guys. Uh, she was very colorful. She was very sociable. She was very fashionable, high fashion. Uh, a few years ago, in 2016, her son, um, who works for a very well-known financial company, I think that would be KPGM or something like that, in New York, got married to a Dominican uh, uh, lady. It was a high society wedding. I mean, uh, B.C. Olatilo was in that wedding. It was, I mean, who and who in the society were there from the top in the political power of corridor in Abuja to Lagos, everywhere, all over Nigeria, home and abroad, they came and they attended that wedding. It was a huge event at Nelly's place in Lagos. And that was in 2016. So rest in peace, Big Chi. Rest in peace. Bye-bye. It's your favorite baby, your favorite TT. Tea time spiller. Hot news spiller. Kirsty Valentine.